Mtamangira's decision to back fired coach Peter de Villiers seems to have cost him the captaincy. The Zimbabwe 15s rugby player held a press conference after the former Springboks coach was fired by the Zimbabwe Rugby Union, putting their weight behind him. Let it categorically be stated that I have not received any correspondence to the effect that I have been suspended or I am required to appear before any disciplinary committee. I therefore make this statement as a substantive captain of the Sables and anything to the contrary is mere ESA. Four senior players stood in solidarity with their captain against the Aaron Jani led ZRU executive. Zimbabwe rugby has degenerated to an unacceptable levels in order for us to retrieve a semblance of respect and pride in the sport. Agent intervention <coughs> is required. We have the capacity to excel, but without the right foundation, we are doomed. As a result of the above, and for the sake of all passionate about rugby in Zimbabwe, I therefore invite the current Zimbabwe Rugby Union Board to step down to pave the way for an interim committee to be set up and the forensic audit instituted immediately. Yeah, um... We fully support our captain and we're behind him. And um, we believe Zimbabwe, the rugby is for everyone, but it has been personalized. You're not able to get an equal chance to represent the country, but we all want to do that. Yeah. So we stand behind him and uh, we look forward to seeing this process through. The players have now received the backing of Member of Parliament Temba Mliswa, creating a huge rift in Zimbabwe rugby. I am here to ensure that there's accountability and transparency in the way things are done. Uh, it is important to understand that sports in general in the country is in a mess. Zifa, the treasurer, steals 750,000 steals because he diverted it into his personal account with his brother. And no one says anything. The president was very clear the fundraising uh, dinner of the Warriors saying that there will be no corruption in sport. In the past two weeks, the scandal between the Zimbabwe Rugby Union and the national team players, as well as other parties, has opened a whole can of worms. Now it remains to be seen in which direction Zimbabwe Rugby is going to go after this scandal. Amitai Mutiniri for ZTN Sports in Harare.